All right, guys, uh, today it's decision time. Um, I'm struggling with a pretty big decision right now. Gunslux is like getting to a spot where I really need to start promoting it or uh, do more about those kind of things, marketing and everything. Um, the problem right now is, do I look for a publisher for this game or will I just self-publish it like I usually do? Um, this is mostly for the PC version. I plan to just do the mobile version like I always do, publish it myself because I have an audience on mobile, most of you guys, and um, that's really where my strength is. But the PC version, um, I'm not very good at the PC marketing part. I can't really reach the audience I want and I need to get good sales on PC. So the option is, do I look for a publisher or not? That's really the biggest decision I'm currently struggling with. And I really need to make this decision because if I go with a publisher, I'll need to find a publisher. So I'll need to contact a few and send, their, send the current build of the game to them. Um, if I don't go to a publisher, then I'll have to set up store pages and start really marketing and pushing this game by myself. And then I'll have to decide if I want to do uh, early access or a beta version or something uh, all those decisions will have to be made so right now the big thing is publisher or not all right so um, I wrote down a few points usually I just try to talk and do everything on camera but for this I really wrote down a list of ideas and things that popped in my head because I really need to make the decision so I needed to have a sort of like a pro and con list. Um, let me see, well obviously um, finding a publisher, the biggest reason for that is that I hope they are capable of pushing my game to uh, more press, uh, to more people and just sell a lot more copies than I'll reach. Um, let's say my PC games do a few thousand copies over a couple of years. I'm hoping a publisher does uh, 10,000 or more in just the first month or two. Um, so that's really a, a pro for having a publisher. Um, but it's also, well, finding a publisher is one thing. You never know if they'll be able to push your game that much. So it's a, it's a tough decision. So right now there are maybe three publishers that I have in mind for this. Uh, one of them I know very well. I've, I've been working with them on and off in all these years. So I know these guys. Um, there are a few other publishers that are just very good for indie games. So those are good publishers. There are a lot of publishers you don't want to contact in this type of situation because they'll mostly just take games to fill up their catalog and they'll dump it on the market. And that's something I can do myself as well. So that's I, if I get a publisher, I really want them to reach at least 10,000 or more uh, players and gamers. So they also need to have contacts with press. I want my game to be shown on the big game sites for PC. Um, that's something I can't get in as much as I tried. Um, I can mail them, I can contact them, but hardly get written about on PC game sites. So that's really why I want a publisher. Um, but there are, of course, a few reasons why I wouldn't want to have a publisher. Uh, the main one is, well, I'll have to uh, give control about my game away to somebody else. So um, I, the game will be published under their name, not under the Orange Pixel brand name. So um, I can't do things like discounts and sales because that will all go through the publisher. Um, I can't do giveaways. There will be uh, things like early access. Will it be? possible with a publisher and what will they want to say about my game because I'm still independent and I want to stay independent so I want to have the final say on my game uh, but I can understand that a good publisher wants to steer games into a certain direction because they know it works in a certain market so um, cons and pros it's it's a it's a lot of difficult decisions um, and I still haven't decided I really want to have a publisher and really want to see if they can really make the game sell a lot of copies so that uh, my PC income and my PC audience grows and I get a lot more gamers. But on the other hand, those gamers would know about the publisher and maybe not so much about me as a developer. Also, I wouldn't have contact with those gamers because they would be a contact for the publisher. I wouldn't have be able to um, 
send those people an email or a newsletter or things like that so there's always a layer between me and those gamers and of course the important thing about this is why and why I'm looking for it now is because if I don't get a publisher or don't want to find a publisher I'll have to start doing a lot more marketing and not just the posts on Twitter here and there. I also have to make the decision, do I want the game to go in early access? Then I'll have to set up the Steam page, uh, the store page for it and all those things. I um, have to decide on the price point and um, there's a lot that goes on and a lot that has to do with finding a publisher or not and this decision. Uh, I know one thing for the mobile version, I just want to do it all myself because that's what I've been doing all these years. I just wanted a bigger PC audience and I'm not getting where I want to. So yeah, it's a tough decision, hard decision. Um, I have been looking at publishers with other games before. I think with Space Grunts I tried it and um, Gunslugs probably. Can't really remember. I think one of those, or Gunslugs 1 or Gunslugs 2. I looked for publishers. Um, I asked a few and they weren't interested at that point. Um, I didn't really continue looking. And with Ashworld I had the same problem. Uh, looking for a publisher or do it myself. And eventually I did all those games by myself without a publisher. Um, but the question is just still, can a publisher push my games to a bigger audience? That I, the only way to answer that question is probably just look for a publisher and just try it so um, maybe this game I'm just gonna try it and see if it works um, but as I said I'm still not sure there are just a lot of things that go through my head uh, I've been thinking about it for a few weeks now and I had a few great talks with publishers already um, yeah I'm, I'm just gonna I'm, I'm j I'll keep you guys updated on what the decision will be um, for now I just wanted to have this little video it's different from all my previous videos I just wanted to talk about the struggles and the, just little things because in the end it doesn't really matter a lot if I go with the publisher or not the game is going to be made it's going to be released and we're going to move on to the next game but um, these things can make a huge difference between well uh, having a lot of revenue coming in so I can work a lot longer on my next game or having to rush into the next game because I need more revenue coming in this year um, it's business decisions and I do like them Although sometimes they're just very difficult to uh, really get to the decision and um, make the decision. So that's it for this week's video. I do hope you like this kind of video. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, let me know if you think I should be going to a publisher or not with Gunslugs. Um, I'm just curious. I'm still going to do my own opinion and my own mind. But I'm just curious what you think about uh, publisher or no publisher. So let me know and um, I'll see you guys next week. Bye!